Hello and welcome. In this video, I will show you the performance of the modified Xiaomi Hyper OS in F4 GT. Let's see if this modded OS will have the same performance as any other custom ROM. Is the old flagship phone still worth it for emulation gaming than any other handheld Android consoles? Let's see what is really worth it for emulation. Let's start. What we have now is the Poco F4 GT, I mentioned in my previous videos about custom ROM. Now I will try to test the Gurren Bones modded Hyper OS, as I just know it is a stable Indonesia version, and this is more information about this ROM. And here's the results of my game test.
What the fuck's name would you do? After the games that I have tried on different emulators, I can say that the stock ROM or default Xiaomi Hyper OS is not that bad. If they just improve their operating system, remove unwanted apps that consume RAM to cause the slowness of a phone. I can also say that a modified ROM like this is effective and stable. After I test the CPU throttle I got stable for 5 minutes which is better than before. Also some quick benchmark. Maybe I will stay for a while on this custom modded ROM and test more. What about your thoughts on this video, please comment down, and if you find my video helpful please leave a like or subscribe to my channel to always notify you on my latest video. Thanks for watching, see you in my next update.